Hi, uh, welcome to field test number two of the Pi camera project. So different thing from uh, field test number one, today I'm connecting to the Pi uh, using Wi-Fi Direct. And uh, I got a new fancy enclosure for my camera. So my wife is a uh, big fan of Starbucks, so I've sort of retrofitted a Starbucks cup and put everything in there. Um, I don't know if you can see, so here's the camera module. And then here's the Pi, and then here's the big battery bank on the side. So uh, I have already established Wi-Fi direct connection between um, the camera, oh, between the camera and the Pi. So I'm just gonna sit on my car, and I'll show you that it does work. So let's just head into the shades. Otherwise, it's quite difficult to see my uh, my phone screen. So can you can you see this? Okay, so as you can see, uh, I'm not actually connected to any Wi-Fi network right now, um, but let's go to the Wi-Fi direct page. So as you can see, I have already connected to a Realtek DMP device, which is the camera sitting on top of my car right now. So uh, let's try to VLC to it. Oh, uh, it's working out quite perfectly. There are a couple cars just coming in right now. So, can you just point at the uh, the camera, the Pi again? Yeah. So, so the Pi is currently live streaming data to my phone right now using Wi-Fi Direct. Um, another thing I wanted to show you was the range of this between the Pi camera and my phone. Um, we measured it to be roughly 17 meter ish, uh, like the theoretical best. But the problem is it's actually very difficult to show because when you're 70 meter away from the camera it's quite difficult to see where it actually is and there's no easy way of showing it so we decided not to to show you that um but yeah so i'll probably post another instructional video on how to set up wi-fi direct between your phone and the, uh, and the camera uh thank you